know, I always, I always knew uh, that there were there were stunt women, but watching movies, I don't say, oh, that must have been a stunt woman right there. You know, I don't really ever see them. They just use short men with wigs. The relationship between the actor and the stunt double is vital. You have to make the actors feel safe. I never do my own stunts. I don't even think about doing my own stunts. The product has to be believable. I landed on the speedometer right here, cracking my mandible in three places. The result was a broken back. I moved my storm and I was in a neck place for six months. You seriously, seriously hurt yourself. Think of myself as a warrior. I'm a fighter. I didn't know the importance of having a stunt double. I was told that there was not an African American my size in the industry in stunts. That didn't mean anything to me. I was like, show me the money. I, you know, I'm not interested in jumping out of high buildings you know, or, or falling out of cars. You know, stuff. Those, these women are trained professionals. The environment for African American women is what we're critical of them making mistakes. Women seem to be more excluded. It's not an easy business to be in. I didn't know that it was a serious issue in stunts until I went to get my first job. Caucasian women doubling African American stunt women. But I'm on the set, you know, and uh, we're rehearsing before we even started shooting. And so the stunt doubles come in. She was white. And I just didn't understand that. The paint down effect exists for both men and for women. To me, it's just, it's so insulting. There's so many African American stunt actresses. There are so many that are talented. We don't get to see them. This is one of the most conservative, sexist, uh, and somewhat racist industry that we have in this country.